Apoptosis is an essential part of the cell cycle. It is a programmed cell death that occurs during development and normal biological processes of cells. One of the key components of apoptosis is the family of enzymes called caspases. There are 12 of these cysteine activated aspartame derived proteases and they are essential throughout the apoptotic pathway. Caspase activation is initiated by two main pathways. The extrinsic pathway involves the activation of ligand bound death receptors of the tumor necrosis factor receptor family. These receptors consist of a death domain, an intracellular protein interaction domain where the disc complex is formed for the induction of apoptosis. This causes the activation of procaspase 8 to form caspase 8 via proteolytic cleavage. Caspase 8 then proteolytically cleaves procaspase 3 or procaspase 7 to form activated caspase 3 and caspase 7. This triggers the activation of the death substrates that lead to apoptosis. The intrinsic pathway is initiated when the cell undergoes stress events. These events will heighten the levels of BAD in the cytoplasm the BLC2 and BLCXL will then bind to these and initiate the release of BAX and BAC proteins. The insertion of BAX and BAC proteins into the mitochondria will cause the release of pro-apoptotic proteins such as cytochrome C and apoptosis inducing factor into the cytosol. The apoptosome complex is then formed by the interaction of cytoplasmic cytochrome C with APAF1, procaspase 9 and DATP. This complex will activate initiator caspase 9 which then activates the effector caspases 3 and 7 to induce apoptosis via the death substrates. The activation of the intrinsic pathway can also lead to the formation of the apoptosome complex and additional caspase activity. Once the effector caspases are activated, they induce cleavage of a number of death substrates. These substrates are involved in nuclear fragmentation, the disruption of the cell's cytoskeleton, and alterations to the cell membrane to produce apoptotic bodies and reduction of the organelles within the cells. These cell fragments and apoptotic bodies are then recognised and removed by the body's immune system by phagocytes. In summary, apoptosis begins when the cell undergoes stress. This induces the release of pro-apoptotic signals that send the cells down either the extrinsic or intrinsic pathway. These pathways both involve the activation of initiator and effector caspases that activate the death substrates. It is these death substrates that cause a range of cellular changes that lead to apoptosis.